welcome everybody i'm back with another video for you guys so let's jump into it i want to see we're going to start off with the millennial oracle deck this is for the collective all right so this is going to be for all signs and we're going to see what's going on with the collective what message is there for the collective If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. Wow, y'all been getting this energy a lot lately. Is somebody spying on you? Somebody is watching you become um, insta-famous or just like get a huge following online. You're in a spotlight. You're getting some type of recognition. Some type of recognition. You're very popular. Um, and you're very confident. They feel like you're very confident. Somebody is sitting back watching you grow an audience, okay? Somebody is sitting back spying on you. Spying. Spying. Somebody watching, watching you. They said, well, damn. They come for this level through the roof, okay? Y'all done became really popular. And they're, they're watching. Now... This has them really surprised. They could have they could have benched you. They could have put you on hold. Because they thought the grass was greener. So it looked like they swerved in another lane. This person could have been trying to dodge you and not, you know, show any interest to you. But really they're sitting back watching you. They're sitting back watching, spying. Yes, this is online. This is online, okay? They're wishing that they could, um, that you and them could have still been together, like been a partnership. But this person breadcrumbed you. They breadcrumbed you, and now you're looking real, real good. A relationship ended, okay? Because we got lost interest, flatlining. A relationship or situation is dying. Conversation went dead. Um, yeah, bounce. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you looking real good now. And now they over here sad. They in their feelings. Okay. It could be a whole squad. It could be a clique of friends, a group of friends, um, or somebody that you was close to. Okay. Somebody that you were close to. They're sitting back. They're going through something now. And it looks like you have elevated and you're moving towards something greater. Now they're sitting back in the cut watching you. This is somebody who benched you, who thought less of you, who may have found somebody else to be cool with, be around, could have switched groups up on you. Um, and now it looks like you are elevating. You're elevating. You're looking good. Maybe y'all been in the gym, working out. Your body looks good. You're very attractive. Um, and this person is over here. This is their energy right here. This is their energy. Relationship struggles or ended Missing someone, emotional, lonely, depressed, sad. So this person miss being around you. Okay, they miss being around you. They gave you crumbs um, and tried to play you. Okay, now they sitting back looking at the situation and wishing that, you know, they didn't treat you the way that they treated you. Wow. That comeback was something serious, ain't it? What does this person want to say? I'm starting to understand our connection. And I feel you even though we're apart. Okay, so this person still feels, still holding on to feelings when it comes to you. Um, and they're starting to get an understanding of what part you played in their life. After, you know, this was after, after. They saw you doing something for yourself. And it looks like whatever you're doing, you're doing very well at it. And you're winning. So now this person is feeling some type of way. Now this person is feeling some type of way. Show me this person's energy. What is this person feeling? How do they feel about the collective?
They were wishing that they treated you better. Then I tell you, they spying on you. Okay. Yes, they've been competing with you for a very long time. This person has been in competition. This could be a friend, okay? Somebody that you were close to. There's a lot of gossiping going on about you. And this person um, has been in competition with you. They've been competing with you the whole time, okay? It looks like you've made some big changes. It looks like you made some big changes. Like it's like after you and this person's connection ended, things started to go in your favor. Okay, especially with that ten of wands and that will right there. We got the Empress and the Two of Cups. So they feel like they want to heal this connection with you. Temperance and the Two of Cups. They want to heal this connection with you. I'm here and try to call you, try to reach out to you. Okay, somebody loves you, Queen of Cups and the Lovers. This person wants to tell you how they feel about you. They want to try to heal the connection. But they're waiting to reach out to you. I'm hearing like, it looks like you're having a lot of fun. Okay, it looks like you're enjoying yourself. So they're kind of like waiting to reach out to you. Okay. Yeah, this person is heartbroken. Three of swords and a six of swords. This person, this is a masculine. They know that they feel like they weren't man enough for you. Okay, because we got the emperor right here, the death core, and the hierophant. So they're sad that they have to move on and they have to watch you from the sidelines. They got to participate on the sidelines. Okay, they don't get to be a part of this journey with you. And I feel like they feel some type of way. There is a lot of gossip or a lot of talk about you. A lot. A lot. Like your name is being brought up in rooms you not you don't even know. This could be a King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I'm getting Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Taurus. Aries, this person wants to see you. They want to heal things with you with this star card here. It could be an Aquarius. They want to heal things, heal this connection. They've been thinking about you a lot. You've been on their mind. Maybe you two decide to take a break from each other. What else? Six of Pentacles. I'm hearing should have gave that some thought before the situation got as bad as it did. Um, they want to talk to you. They want to reach out, but they're kind of afraid to reach out right now because they feel like they aren't, you know, don't have enough or they don't qualify to even be in your presence okay i feel like this is a masculine energy how does this person feel about the collective they feel like you're content with how the situation is right now they want to come towards you. We got home and journey. They want to come towards you. You're like home to them. They're bored of the situation that they're in and very sad and emotional. Okay, they're very emotional right now because you were this person's happy place. 
Use this person happy place. So the situation that they're in now, whoever they're dealing with now, whatever they got going on right now, I feel like they're bored of, you know, just kind of like being home all the time. Um, and they're very much so in their feelings because you was that happy place. And now they don't have that anymore. They don't have you in their corner anymore. Yeah, see, they want to get this connection. They want to work on this partnership with you. And they're still open to this connection. They're still open to it. But we got it is safe to love. And it's in the reverse. It jumped out in the reverse. Okay, so maybe there's a trust factor here. I feel like somebody feels as if it's not safe to come towards you right now. Like, maybe you're guarded. Yep, it's a trust factor. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's no trust in this connection. It was too much playing around, too much playful energy. So, right now, this person is focused on their finances. Okay, they're looking at their money. But they're still open. And I feel like they're waiting their turn. I'm here waiting their turn. Because they want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you. Okay? But there is a trust factor here. Okay, there's no trust in this connection. So that's what I got, guys. If this message resonated with you, be sure to leave a comment. Let me know what's going on in this comment section. I always check and read my comments as well, guys. If you're interested in booking a personal reading, my contact information is in the drop box below. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Actually, it's in the comment section. It's pinned. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.